Doctor Yu! Morgan! Up here, Officer Cool. If we can't open the main door, or our friends are gonna pour through. Get up to the catwalk, we'll get you inside. So, I thought you would know. You obviously don't understand what I do. And I didn't order any deployer. Reployer. Ask somebody in engineering. I did. I've been asking everyone. No one ordered it or knows anything about it. Weird. Well, perhaps I can come down this evening and take a look at it. That'd be great. Thanks, Lane. Yeah, no problem.
System alert. Repairs needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. adjustment required. You all right? Morgan? I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transtar mounting a rescue operation? I was in fuel storage when... when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But they weren't running from the fire, it was these shapes. I had contained the fire and... I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those... things. Everyone I worked with... They're dead, aren't they? I wonder if one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? Dr. Yu, again, I want to thank you for the timely rescue. I hope you recall me, Dr. Igwe. Dio Igwe. Your brother, Alex, brought me to the station to head up Neuromod research. I have one, but no aptitude template. We're saving it, but... Well, now might be best. Here, I'm sure you could make better use of it. Microgravity upsets my equilibrium. I need to steady myself after the slow roll of the crate. I could feel it, turning, you know? 
my stomach along with it. Closest I've ever come to vertigo and claustrophobia. Must be a neuromod that could cure that. You look like you need a medical operator. God, watching those things move Igwe makes me sick. I go great outside the ship. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than anyone. What is it doing? Oh my God, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things, like it, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. Ugh, corpse? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it saved him. It could still be Enoch. Does it look like it? Sam, promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now, I'm going to check the perimeter. If you find a way out of here, take Dr. Igwe with you. Maybe he can be of some help. Elsewhere. Hey, Dr. Are you Igwe there, Chief? figures he'd say. Yes. So you came all this way? I wanted to speak only to you about the most talent? recent VIP. The only way in is through the door to Cargo Bay B, which is filled with those creatures that your brother insisted couldn't escape confinement. Kind of like you. I'm the only one with the code. It's yours if you can help us secure the firepower we should have had when assigned here. The Eradicator Turret Fabrication Plan. My men told me power's been restored to the Fabricator. That was you, wasn't it? I was quick to underestimate you, Doctor. That means all we need is the turret fabricator plan. There's one in the safe in the security office, but the hull breach puts it out of my reach. Still, if you have a suit and are up for another walk, we could really use the additional firepower. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember, the only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive. 